question 11. Okay, this question is quite easy. Uh, it uh, is a redox reaction. Uh, so which statement about this reaction is correct? So we uh, focus on the this uh, lab, the, the PB, this one, this metal, uh, because all this answer is about the lab. So for this one, the oxidation number is zero. For this oxidation number, okay, because oxygen is negative two times two, it's negative four. So the oxidation number for this lead is positive four. So on the product side, this is the lead sulfate. So sulfate itself, is negative 2 and this one therefore is positive 2 so for this one we know that the lead is from 0 to positive 2 so which is oxidation and from positive 4 to positive 2. The oxidation number decreases, so it's a reduction. So means the lead is undergo oxidation and the reduction. Okay, so answer is A. So lead is both oxidized and reduced. Okay, next. Question 12. This one is the reactions between the KMnO4 with the iron 2 under acidic condition. So in order to solve this question, it's better for you to construct the half equations and you combine. Then you'll get the correct coefficient. So let's start with the first half equation. From this um, permanganate ion or MnO4 negative so it will reduce to Mn2 positive so you start with this one first after that you balance it so the manganese is 1 1 so no need to balance the manganese so you need to balance oxygen balance oxygens using H2O so you have to put 4H2O on right hand side. So make sure oxygen here is balanced. So since here there are 4 oxygens, so here you need to put 4H2O, 4 oxygen. After that, you need to balance hydrogen. So you need to put H plus on left hand side to balance this hydrogen's number. 4 times 2 total 8 hydrogen so here you need to put 8 H plus so last part is you need to balance the charge so here total charge is uh, 2 positive so you need to make sure here also same so because here is negative negative so it's 8 positive right so therefore here you need to put five electrons so five electrons so means uh, with uh, this uh, this uh, one negative so therefore both sides will be uh, two positive or positive two so after that um, you have to uh, get the second half equation so from the this iron two oxidized to iron three release one electron because the first half equation involves 5 electrons so here you need to times 5 for O make sure 5 electrons for this 2 half equation so once this the half equation times 5 so you can cancel these 5 electrons and you combine all these uh, species involved so combine this left to left right to right Right, so therefore you get this. So the X here is one. 
and the y here is 5 so answer is C okay that's all thank you